Hey, it's Lizzie, and welcome back to the Game Maker Role Playing Game Tutorials. This is the last inventory video, and uh, I'm going to show you how to draw the inventory. Okay, so at this point, maybe you should have um, however many uh, slot uh, objects you want. This is how many slots you'll have in it. Um, in the draw event, have this code. So, um, in uh, the case of my version of the game, the slots um, are uh, see-through, transparent, um, but with a button shape. Um, so, since I use all the same sprites for both in the inventory and the equip slots, um, I, uh, I wanted to have them to have different colors. Um, so the first thing I put for inventory was I draw sprite stretched sprite cream color. So basically I, that draws a a sprite or whatever um, um, like over the uh, inventory area. And uh, then this comes next so that draws the sprite over it. So this basically draws the inventory sp uh, slot sprite. Make sure to set argument one to sprite index, argument sorry, argument zero to sprite index, argument one to image index, and view x view plus x, view y view plus y. Anyways, this uh, here and uh, makes it so um, it'll it'll draw um, the slot um, in the view. Um, um, but wh where uh, you put your, uh, but where you put your um, uh, object in the game, so it makes it much easier to set up than just drawing each individual slot where you want it to be. I'll show you in a sec. But um, anyways, next um, is if amount does not equal zero, and this basically checks if in other words, if there is um, any, if there is an item in the inventory, if there is, uh, if there is an item in the inventory, then do this code. Uh, just draw set color to black. Draw text. Um, uh, in the variable amount, and you can play around with where you want it to be put on your. Uh, slot just to make sure to include the view x view and view view x view plus x um, view y view plus y here and uh, so if your inventory is slot is empty this won't show up and that's good because you don't want it your every blank slot to say zero at least I don't think you do I mean, it could be different Anyways, so all these here are um, the inventory slot objects I have, and I just you know put them in the positions I wanted to, and the code ensures that it's that easy. You don't have to draw each individual slot with code where you want it to be. So yeah, that makes design a lot easier. Um, yeah, so. Um, one last thing I'd like to go over in this video, considering it's the last inventory video. I made it so that if you, um, when you, uh, you can toggle the inventory visibility on and off by pressing the I key. So if you want to do this, um, add a press I key event. And add this code. If pressed equals zero, and in the brackets put visible equals zero, else visible equals one. Then add release i key event. If pressed equals one, brackets pressed equals zero, else pressed equals one. And uh, that's it for inventory. Um, I will uh, 
I'll check out the next video resources and then I will try to get into uh, e equip videos. Um, so then I guess we'll be off to some more exciting stuff. Um, I'm sorry I haven't uh, been very active, but uh, I have an agenda besides designing games. So, well, thanks for watching.